Hello everyone, welcome back to the Zane Prey channel and today we're going to be playing Overwatch. I am playing as Sombra, as you can see it is pretty awesome. Now this is some gameplay footage I've recorded already and I'm just doing a voiceover. Today I'll be talking about the best Overwatch player in the world. So this is going to be pretty pretty awesome. Now she plays Overwatch and she is really good. It's some of the best Overwatch gameplays I've seen. And people have criticized her for cheating. People have criticized her for using some kind of bot or hacking ability. But I don't think so. She is really just that good at Overwatch. Look at this video and tell me what you think. Check this out. So these are just some, some videos of her playing Overwatch. And it is proof that she doesn't need any help. She's not cheating. It's just a proof of video showing that she's just sitting there in front of the computer and playing Overwatch straight up. No cheating, no bot, no nothing. It's just proof. And Blizzard has a lot of strict rules against cheating. Now, the reason why she got criticized for cheating is because of how amazing she is at Overwatch and how amazing accurately she is at pinpointing where she should fire at she has an, a, an accuracy that's beyond top level like she is the best i've seen and um she's gathered a lot of fame because of how good she is at overwatch and and how she plays and what people like so like i said blizzard tends to be very 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 strict when it comes down to stuff like this blizzard do not tolerate cheating if you cheat blizzard will find out and when they do they're gonna block you that's literally it you're gonna be blocked and there's nothing you can do literally once you get blocked there's nothing you can do i've in fact heard about people who tried who tried renaming their address renaming, renaming their computer you know all kinds of stuff just to start playing overwatch again they've tried everything literally changing their name changing their bank cards and it doesn't work they buy overwatch and in a couple of hours or a couple of days blizzard shut it down again because blizzard know who they are so it's a very serious thing when it comes to cheating blizzard do not tolerate it so if she was cheating i can assure you blizzard would not tolerate it you know so in the esport community professional players are actually or were actually saying she she was cheated two professional players have actually said that if they found out that she is not cheating they will quit literally quit that is really messed up like i've never knew people to quit the game simply because someone else is better at it than they are nevertheless i think they're m mostly upset that she's a girl and that she is so good she is impossibly good L just look at this right here you remember what i said when i said she has amazing accuracy better than anyone i've ever seen better than anyone the world and the esport community has ever seen just look at how she at, at how she plays and you'll see for yourself that she has an amazing accuracy just look at how she does it look at this look at that her accuracy does not leave the point it's always point on point on and as soon as the enemy moves she is back on him or you know just just kicking ass really so she's really good at what she does and it's 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 no it's no joke so she and her manager have gone a long way to prove that she is not cheating and they've got official emails from blizzard saying that she is not cheating because blizzard actually investigated this because they wanted to find out for themselves and blizzard investigated and said she is not cheating she is just playing the game as a regular person should and a, as, a, as a regular person would she is not cheating and some people still refuse to believe 
that she isn't cheating because that's how good she is. She is really good. Everyone else was really jealous at the minute, so you know it's fair to say that she is kicking butt. Now, in the esports community, there's actually other Overwatch players that has threatened her. She's a 17-year-old girl, and she's been threatened. Her life is being threatened. There's an Overwatch player. I can't say who because I can't confirm it properly. But there's an Overwatch player that actually threatened her and said that if it's proven that she's not cheating and his career will be ruined because he said she's cheating, he will go to her house with a Come knife. On. That is so, so wrong. I've never heard anything like that. That is bullshit, to be Come honest, on, because dude. if you're going to go to a person's house with a knife, simply because you think that they are cheating or just because you're jealous you're gonna show up to their house with a knife that is wrong in so much ways it's not right so it just shows that people out there are really not happy that she is that good but at the same time there's also people out there who are really really happy that she is that good because it proves that people can actually be that good at this game without cheating you know but it's a very rare thing it's not just anyone who could be this good it's literally one out of a billion or one out of a million what I I'd say one out of a million just to be just to be sure because um there's a small number of people who play overwatch compared to the population of earth so I say one out of a million but overall she is really good now in, in Blizzard, in Overwatch, uh, the community, this is not the first on. time they've experienced these kind of allegations. Speaking on another allegation, they've experienced real life cheating. There's actually people out there who do cheat, and I don't know how they do it, but somehow they're clever enough to figure out ways how to cheat. Now, I'm not sure why they cheat because there is no real pleasure in it. If I was playing a video game, and I constantly kept on cheating. It's not really fun. It's not fun. You know, it it just wouldn't it just wouldn't feel right. I can't imagine doing that because it just doesn't feel right. Can you imagine playing a game and you just constantly winning, but you're a fake? You know, you're a fake. You're in fact the worst player, and because you're cheating, you're constantly winning just to make yourself feel better or just to just to be famous. That's a waste of bloody time and it's embarrassing so this is my opinion on the on the situation i think she's a fantastic player and i think she should continue doing what she loves doing and i love playing overwatch too so i'm going to continue doing as i do so that's all i've got to say for today guys so thank you for watching subscribe to the channel and like this video i will see you in the next one